This is Farm Industry News. We're here at the National Farm Machinery Show on the first day, and we're expecting very good attitudes on part of the farmers who will be out here, as well as the manufacturers. Continued high commodity prices is driving a lot of this enthusiasm. And in fact, this morning we just heard some big news about John Deere, and we have Barry Nelson who's going to tell us a little bit about the news. Barry? Well, thank you, Karen. Uh, yes, this morning we just announced our first quarter results. Had record results, $369 million in sales and revenues worldwide uh, for the quarter. Uh, and what is really refreshing to see is the outlook for the year. We revised that uh, forecast upwards from 10 to 15 percent to 15 to 20 percent. So you can see the positive result uh, that, that the commodity prices have had. But not only that, it's also the expanding global markets uh, that John Deere's involved in. Um, Barry, there's a lot of optimism. What are the uh, drawbacks or concerns? I know you have mentioned just a few. Uh, some of the drawbacks is rising input costs that go along with that, and so we have to work uh, hand in hand uh, with our suppliers, with our dealers, and with our customers to try to bring new technology that will help them still become more efficient and productive in all the things that they do. But at the same time, because farmers that are growing crops right now are, are making pretty good profits, uh, it, uh, there's quite a demand for farm machinery. But of course, you get in the livestock sector and you look at lo some of the rising uh, feed prices, there needs to be a balance there. So times are pretty good right now, but again, things need to balance out. Uh, just one more question, Barry. Can a farmer buy or find some new John Deere equipment this year that hasn't been already spoken for? Absolutely. We have different market segments, different machinery that, that uh, we still have availability this year. Uh, we are trying to do every, everything we can individually with each customer to provide the equipment they need on a timely basis. In some instances, they're not going to be able to get it as early as they want, but, but we're working with our dealers to try to, to provide the best solutions for that.